All right, hot dog van man, we're going to follow you on your first little road trip through our newly built... Oh, look at all of them. They're taking it, bro. Oh, we just needed to switch it up a little. We got this. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to City Skylines, jumping in to continue building our city. Now, I've been actually playing this game off screen on my laptop for... A uh, fairly big amount at night when I got off of work and kind of been just chilling. Uh, and I've learned that the freeway system is actually a huge thing when it comes to making sure that people can get around the city fast and also get from the industrial areas uh, beyond. So today we're going to be working on some freeways, making sure we get those in now instead of later because I have, uh, like I tried to tell you guys before, I also got some mods installed too, so you guys probably see stuff that you guys, uh, if you play this game, know with the mods. So it's going to make it a little bit easier. I've also unlocked all 21 tiles, uh, so now we have way more room to work with when it comes to our area. So in my one game that I'm playing uh, on my laptop, I have all of this filled out. It's like all of this, actually. Uh, all of this filled out. I'm starting to fill out here, and I'm filling out a little bit here. I've learned, though, with the freeway system that I have a lot less businesses shutting down when I have freeways that kind of connect all the industrial areas together to get goods from one place to another. Along with that, I've also found that adding storage houses or containers or places like that also are a good thing considering the fact that they can store the goods that they create inside those warehouses. So that's kind of what we're going to be doing today, uh, making some warehouses along with some freeway systems. So that way, when we continue to grow our city, uh, we could do so in a manner that makes it, uh, you know, longevity and it actually can make it fucking go longer than it should. So let's go ahead and get this started here. So I'm glad I'm kind of doing this now because if I wouldn't be doing this now, it would actually make it a shit show when the whole map is kind of put together. So we want to go to our freeways. Uh, we're going to see a lot more roads in here as well, too, just due to the fact that we have uh, some mods in that's going to make it more intense. So how we want our freeway system to kind of go here. Now, this is the part that I hope you guys can assist me with is uh, the intersections and the freeway intersections that collide. Now, I want to be able to put uh, freeways over roads sometimes. But when I do so, I've understood how to do it by doing uh, page up and page down. That's how you can put stuff in the ground and also uh, above ground as well, too. Now, my only question with that is when you go to do it, I'll show you guys what I mean. So I draw this, okay? It's already making a bridge. I can make that bridge taller to go over something. Now, that's great, but it's making a bridge out of a freeway. I don't want it to make a bridge. Like, say if I'm trying to just go, for instance, uh, from here to here. See how it's not looking like a bridge? But sometimes it will look like a bridge. That looks like a normal kind of raised freeway, you know, to some extent. That, that definitely does. So I could put that over certain areas in the city to allow us to be able to get from one place to another faster. Uh, we also have a mod in that I can quickly do Control-Z because... God forbid in this game you actually do make fuck-ups and it kind of just fucks everything up sometimes. So, uh, moving on from there, we're going to go ahead and uh, attempt to create a freeway exit from here. So what I want to do is I want something a little smaller. Uh, it's going to be a one-way with sound barrier. So I wonder if I can just kind of come out from here. Uh, we'll make something like this. And it'll be like a nice little extension that kind of goes out. And this is where we're going to start off to the left here. So this is going to be a freeway exit, okay? Uh, so I want to bring this exit down kind of towards the industrial area. So we want to make this a bigger freeway as well too. But I say before we do that, let's go ahead and kind of make a nice little curve here. So that way when people exit the freeway, uh, they're exiting in a safe manner. That's not too fucking direct or anything. So uh, here we're going to have a situation where um, we're going to need to cross over a road here. So I guess I can put my new found skills to the test here and we can do page up and we can, let's see, that's a little too big. So that'll work right there. That's just a normal freeway. So we're going to raise that up. I want to also make sure that I'm not too far with the uh, curve here. So we go something like that. Now, I hope I can continue uh, to do this. So I should be able to just... Oh, my God. Mods make this so much easier, bro. It's actually kind of sad. <laughs> like, holy shit, dude. So if this is going to work the way I think it is, we might actually have some good stuff here. So I'm going to be able to turn this freeway over to where we go but then again we have eyedropper so why do that when we can do this so we want to bring this freeway back down that's the main thing that we've got to work on now uh, but we want to make sure we don't have too aggressive of uh corners going on here there we go and we're going to have a little slight turn so we're going we're going to have this on the coast so what we can do here is we have it raised as you can see so we can have roads kind of go underneath it 
uh, so we can kind of keep our city looking good. So I'm going to drop this down one. We're going to start uh, decreasing on our height here. I want to kind of go as light as possible. That way we don't have... Uh... Oh, see, this is perfect. See, it's going to make it want to cross over the, uh, the berm anyways here. Oh, well, look at that. We could just have it go right down into that. And that's how you could tell it's a freeway uh, exit there because it has the... Bros, does it actually have street signs? Oh, shit. They're fucked up, but you can't hardly read them, but it works. Okay, so now you're looking at this. You're like, okay, it looks good, but there's some areas that, like, do not look super good with, like, just the this, this stuff there. So what we can do is we've got the move it. Uh, so we can go to a node here. And we can kind of move stuff to our liking to make it look a little better uh, for the drivers that are on the road there instead of it being all jank and shit. Okay, I'm liking that. The road looks good. We do have a little bit of a lot of curving going on here, but in the end of the day, obviously, curving is somewhat normal. Uh, let's just go ahead and test it and see. We have this road fully connected right now, so we can kind of get stuff going. I gotta admit, though, it does look 20 million times better when you have freeways that raise and stuff like that instead of it just being flat freeways and shit. It's a moment of truth. Are they gonna take the uh, exit? There is not a lot of traffic coming into our, our town here. That's the interesting part. Come on, someone take it, man. I just need to know it works. Verify me the path. So I'm thinking it's too much of a direct turn for someone to take. So we might have to finagle it just a little bit here to kind of get it actually working. Because uh, I'm not sure. I've had this issue the last time that I uh, just did the freeway systems as well, too. So what I can try to do here is attempt to move some of this around so that way it makes it more of a on-ramp for these people, or an exit. Because uh, right now we have, obviously, it's just like a little too much of a turn, I want to say, for the people to actually take. Uh, so let's see what we could do here. And okay, that's better. We have a little bit of grass coming through here. This is a problem about using mods and fucking with games that you really shouldn't uh, <laughs> when it's not like stock. Okay, so we're getting no travelers traveling on this path here, which is a little weird considering the fact that we should. Uh, we're looking at low demand for commercial zone as well, too. So we're going to start getting some more businesses uh, kind of over here. So that way we have just a little bit more going on. I really need residential, too. As you can see, uh, residential is on fire right now. And people are trying to move into our beautiful city. Uh, so we're going to get some nice homes kind of set up in the area here. And they're going to swoop on that shit almost immediately. Any takers on our freeway yet? No. No takers on the freeway. So, what I've learned to fix this is we've got to remove this. So, this freeway is still active, thankfully. They've got to do some absolute jank shit over here to kind of get into this main part of the city. So, what we need to do is we need to reconnect this road in a logistical manner that allows them uh, to be able to use it. So, what if I do a bigger freeway? Maybe that's the same size, but... Okay, so this is where we're going to start coming into some issues here. Because this game loves to just fuck shit up when it comes to actually being able to put something down. Uh, so we're going to backtrack a little bit more here. And let's try this again. So no nothing. Space is already occupied. You goddamn skip, it's already occupied. It's occupied by the freeway that I fucking made. That's what it's occupied by. Okay, so, I see, I could turn on Road Anarchy and we'd be good here, but uh, I don't want to do that. Oh, also, we have no road connection here, so let's go ahead and fix that by doing that really quick. Let's see if that's good enough for people to take. Uh, they're still avoiding it, it seems like, at all costs. We also don't have enough traffic to really be testing this to any degree. I don't know why they're not taking it, though. That's kind of weird. There should be no reason why they're not taking the, uh, the left on-ramp here. Because then this leads them to a different part of the city, which they can get to relatively fast without having to worry about any bullshit. So, uh, this leaves us with the next thing, which now we need a right-hand side one that kind of goes maybe from, like, the outside of the city. Uh, it would be cool if we had, like, some type of freeway system kind of running out in the water here. And I can uh, show you what I mean just a wee bit by doing this here. So, say we want to get to the south end of the map here. Uh, we can make it to where we have... Kind of like a bridge. Now, what we are going to have to do is probably go... Can we go underneath? Ooh, we can. You know, that would be kind of cool. Go underneath the uh, bridge here. 
So we're going to make a water freeway system so that way they can traverse the whole city without uh, having to go through too much effort there. And we can fix all this stuff up later to make it uh, look a little better and stuff. So this is going to be confusing. So we've got to get over this other bridge that we have that goes into the east part of the map. So I'm thinking about taking it up on land here. And then from here, we can go ahead and we can raise this. And this is why I'm doing most, if not all of this, without uh, road anarchy on. So that way, the game can actually make the road system the way it should. Because that where I've seen to run into a problem here where uh, you try to make your road system. And then all of a sudden, it starts fucking up because you have stuff that's just overlapping on each other and all that. Okay, here we go. I want to try to get it. Bam. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. And then they're almost intersecting at the same spot, too. Which no one is still taking the uh, the exit here, from what I can see, right? It is still completely empty. So I'm not sure why. <laughs> That's not good. Uh, let's go to a bigger road here. I want to put uh, some upgrades in, because we're going to have a freeway here. We're definitely going to want to update this, uh, or upgrade this outer road. Because it's going to be seeing a lot of traffic. Now, what we could do is we can upgrade this before we start gizzing. Uh, gizzing, there it is. Before we start getting a whole bunch of, you know, buildings and stuff over here. Because uh, once we have the buildings, then it's going to make it extremely difficult for us to upgrade without ruining some of these buildings. So we're going to make all of this industrial area have some uh, life to it. Look a little better here. We can't do most of these roads, which is interesting. It's like the intersection points is where everything's fucking up. Okay, so we're going to have to move some of this stuff here uh, because we are running into problems. So I want to upgrade more roads. Uh, this is kind of like just reviving our, our road systems that we have here. Uh, so we've just got to move some stuff to be able to do so. I would like to upgrade this road, but I can't do so with this in the way. So we're just going to move that right here for a second. Now we should be able to upgrade freely minus our... Oh, I think we already have a... Oh, that's a waste transfer facility. Okay. I'm surprised I can even move it. Uh, let's do this quick so that way we don't fuck shit up. And start uh, polluting areas that we don't want polluted. Okay, so, so far that's good. So I can move these back. I've lost a lot of room, which is unfortunate, with these big roads. So I might actually have to go down a little bit in size. Uh, as then I can actually play stuff where I need to. I'm going to pause the game too because we obviously don't have these buildings connected anymore. All right, these middle roads will not be connected by large roads. Uh, that way it just makes it a little easier for us to fit shit in. So I'm going to move this back to where it was. I'm going to move... Where can I move this? I'm going to move that there. We're going to move this over here. And uh, we have an electrical grid set up over here, so we should be good with that. It should go back to normal. Okay, so a little bit of moving that we did. So while we're here, I'm going to go ahead and get a uh, facility set up for our warehouse. Now, the warehouse will be able to store goods. Uh, I'm actually going to remove this as well, too. And then we can go ahead and put uh, our warehouse. Now, I would like a large warehouse. These, these hold a lot of shit. And that's what we kind of need because that's where shit start getting real. So I think I'm going to move into this uh, hill here a little. Oh, here we go. We have to do right click. It'd be nice if I can make the distance a little bigger. Oh, shit. You can. Okay, so what we're doing is we're taking out some of the uh, hill that's here. So that way we can place. That might be a little too aggressive, but I think it'll add land. But we can add some of it back. That should be plenty for us to at least plop this down, yeah? Oh, good. There we go. Uh, so we're going to need to continue this road over here as well, too. Because without continuing this road, they won't have an easy way to be able to get into the facility. So we're just going to kind of connect all that together. That way they can go in and also go out at the same time. Uh, so we're going to do balanced on this. And then we're just going to store commercial goods. Uh, hopefully the workers fill up rather quick. Because we're going to definitely need some uh, help at that place. But it means all of our goods will be able to kind of stay... Uh, where they're at. So let's connect this so that way that gets power. Let's go ahead and watch it turn blue. Please turn blue, blue, blue. Perfect. Okay. That's what I like to see. So has anyone taken our freeway yet? Not a goddamn soul. So we, I feel like we've done something wrong here. 
Uh, and I'm not really sure what it might be, but we've definitely done something wrong. So I'm going to try to move this around a little and see if I can get it to just uh, the game to comprehend what the fuck I'm doing here. I don't want the shit to overlap. There we go. That's an aggressive turn that it has, but it'll do. So if no one is, is messing with this highway, we're going to need to delete it. I have a feeling it's just too much going on right here for the game to really be able to do anything with. Let's just see one taker. Nope, not today. Uh, so we're going to back this up. We kind of fucked up our shit anyways right here. Uh, so we could probably do a little better. I'm going to back up a little bit more. I drop her this. Okay, we're going to make our curve go way closer to this road here. Oh, you know what? That's a good idea, bro. Hold on. So let's see if this does anything come on baby that's gonna be a two-way split take it take the goddamn fucking x oh no one's taking it bro we have a taker it's our first guy let's follow him i want to follow this motherfucker click click there we go uh how do i follow oh shit pause and let's do follow all right hot dog van man we're gonna follow you on your first little road trip through our newly built oh look at all of them they're taking it bro oh we just needed to switch it up a little we got this shit Okay, so the freeway system is working. It's good to go. I'm happy to fucking see that. Because uh, that was kind of like our biggest thing there was getting that freeway system. He's about to get off. He's about to get off. No stop. No cop. No stop. Uh, importing goods to the large warehouse. That's what I like to see. Okay. Uh, how full is it? 1% full. 5 tons out of 750. My other map, dude, it, I had a 750 ton uh, storage unit. Within 3 minutes, that thing was filled up to like 650 tons. It was fucking insane. Okay. So I'm much more happier now that that's working so we can kind of fix this up a little, make it look a little bit better uh, for the drivers. They're like, oh my God, it's an earthquake. The, the ground is moving. Okay, well, that's perfect. That makes, uh, that makes me happy there. And do we have traffic going on this one? I don't think we do because it's not connected anywhere. So why would we have traffic? So this is how we're going to do this. So we want to get some freeway system over here as well too. Uh, this is going to be a northbound freeway. So what we want to do is we want to also connect it with another northbound freeway over here. So I'm thinking maybe like right here we can kind of uh, get an intersection point going. You know how scary it would be to be on a fucking freeway like that without like a bridge system? So we're going to want to turn this around here because uh, we want it to go into each other. Now there's going to be no traffic really that we could do, but at least we have this separation made. So we've done all this. Now we kind of have to worry about a southbound freeway as well too because we have all this set up now i don't want to go too far into the freeway making and uh, have something go critically wrong like here and we're not able to fix it so we're gonna not do too much stuff uh right there but i'd say this looks all pretty damn good i wish i had some traffic going from here but what we could do though is i'm probably sure i can make a little mini freeway that kind of gets onto here to see if it'd work so we can maybe make a freeway onto here Let's see what we got. We had a merge point. Okay, so that's going to be a freeway system. As you can see, it is marked. What does that say? It has a whole bunch of signs, but they literally don't mean anything. So it all is going on the right direction there. Perfect. So they shouldn't be able to merge. So that only mean, it, only people are going to take it, though, if there's a reason to kind of get back up to the north part of the map. Then again, if you're here... And you want to go up here, it would be so much faster to take the freeway than it would be to go through the city. Uh, but I don't think we're going to get any takers right now, unfortunately. It's just not going to happen. So let's look at our residential. We're going to keep working on our residential here. We're going to move some of this stuff back in. Uh, we can probably take out these windmills because our electrical grid is starting to uh, suffice. And that means we don't have to have any new noise pollution or anything like that. Like this one, uh, they can be taken apart too. And uh, if, if something does happen with our electrical grid, we can just add more of these things right here, uh, which is the power lines. So, so far, so good. I'm going to work on this neighborhood as well, too, because our housing demand is just on fire. So we might as well get as much housing as we can in right now. And that'll be one nice little neighborhood. So uh, we have a very low demand for businesses as well, too. So I guess I could just get kind of that worked on really quick, just so it gives them something to kind of pick at. So they're definitely going to need some workers, not enough educated workers. So I do have some schools and stuff, but uh, I really just don't think we have enough population to really be doing anything. 52% of our workers are uneducated. 
22% is educated, 25% is well-educated, and 1% is highly educated. So uh, we've seen better days here, that's for sure. I don't think our institute is actually operating. Uh, we could check the administration building. I think it's this one. Campus area info. Uh, so our attractiveness is 350 out of 200. On our other one that we have, it's like 1,500. It's super fucking high. Uh, we have no students or anything right now. Uh, which is a little bit unfortunate, but I guess that's just kind of is what it is. We haven't got anywhere yet to be able to do that. We can uh, do some free shit here, too. Maybe to make uh, people want to join the fucking college more or something. Well, uh, well, something we really have to do here is we have to add a northbound freeway to our industrial here. Uh, and the reason why... You know what would be cool if we could add a freeway that kind of goes over all this stuff? I think it might be possible. Then we can just route it back around this way. Because I can, well, I can try to do this, but it's going to get a little jank over here. All right, fuck it. I'm down. Okay, so let's see how we're going to do this. So this is going to be our southbound, or I'm sorry, our northbound freeway. We're going to have to get rid of some rocks here. And it's going to, I'm doing this very quickly so that way, because um, we can go through with the fix it later. And make this super good looking. So let's just go ahead and do that. Let's see. Can I get over the freeway? I can't. Son of a bitch. Backtrack a little. So let's raise it once more. Once more? Okay, now we're good. Okay, we're going to stop it right there. I'm going to try to do a nice little turn here to merge down into uh, this road. I don't think it's going to work, though, so we're going to have to... It's going to be a super convoluted freeway mess, but at this point, we're going to make it happen. Okay, so that should be a northbound lane. Again, this was very, very crude. I just want to see if uh, travelers are going to actually take it. Wow, we have zero demand on anything, so I guess it's infrastructure at this point, dude. Holy shit. That's kind of why I like to keep the command, uh, command, the demand high, so that way we have houses that we can build kind of whenever we want. So uh, we're gonna lose some businesses here. I haven't really seen any empty places. Uh, dead person is waiting for transport. Let's check our traffic really quick. I'm just kind of curious to see how we're looking. Honestly, we're looking really good. Our population is still at 4,000, so that's rather small. As you can see here, we do have. This is gonna be a shit show. Because uh, this is what I was talking about. This is what you you guys tried to tell me. When we have intersections that kind of become a mess like this, this is where shit gets real and traffic can really build up. So we've got to kind of figure out how we can go ahead and and undo this messiness. I would assume if I could just do this, that creates one less intersection to have to worry about. I can go ahead and cancel that one. That just becomes its own little thing. And uh, I'd say we just get rid of that. And if someone wants to get into the industrial, what we could do is we can connect a road like this. That way it's a four lane intersection and uh, we could just go, bam. So it's going to get a little messy here, but in the end of the day, it kind of stopped a lot of our traffic from happening right there. As you can see, we're now all green. So this road is going to take you onto the main road, which leads you into another little neighborhood that we're working on. And we're going to have some uh, housing that kind of goes along this as well too, and just works our way all the way down. So. Looking solid. We do have some demand coming up now for commercial. Most likely nothing too crazy. So let's get some small shops in here. They immediately swoop that up. I love seeing that. All right. And we also need some more. Uh, what is this? It's going to be a police station. We could put some houses near the police station. That way though, they're super safe and don't have to fucking worry. So we have some dead space right here. This is uh, our institute for, you know, college and all that stuff. What I think we could do is probably make another road right here, uh, which will allow us to have another neighborhood. So we're going to do something maybe right here. We're going to go in and we're just going to start cutting it up, making us a oh, little neighborhood here. I don't want to go too close to the college because then it's going to fuck up the look of the college there. And that's not what we want. So we'll go out once here on a straight road. And then we're going to bring it back this way and we're going to come over here. It's going to be a rather uh, straight neighborhood, if that makes any sense. Just going to be very straight lines. That sounded worse than it actually was. Okay. We're just going to put another one right there. Honestly, we could probably keep going with it, though. 
just trying to fill out as much room as I can. So that way we don't waste any of these uh, areas here. So this is going to be a neighborhood too. I'm going to downgrade this road just because if it is a housing area, we really don't need a tremendously big road to be able to have here. So we'll just kind of have one smaller. So that way, oh, it's a police station and he's taken off. He's taken off for duty. Housing is starting to climb again too. And now I've got to work my way down respectably. So that way that the power grid connects with itself. We got some, uh, businesses that have just gone belly up. Now you guys said I don't need to delete these because they will kind of regenerate on their own. So if that's the case, we go ahead and not doing that. I have like OCD too, where I start, I like, I see them and I just feel like I need to get rid of them. Oh, let's check our traffic. No one, no one took the road. So we're definitely having a problem here with uh, how the road connects, I think. Which is not for, oh no, we got takers, bro. We got fucking takers. So I'm going to fix the freeway for them then because this shit's all fucked up. Let's see if they're just going to keep... Oh, God. I just made them all swerve. Okay. So we're just going to try to fix this up a little so it looks a little more respectable. Okay. That should be decent for right there. That's a, that's a nasty-ass turn at the end, bro. Holy shit. Okay. Everything's looking good. I like how the freeways kind of laps right there. Okay, so it's good to see our northbound and southbound freeways that we just made working. Um, you know, I really wish I knew how to do what the game did here with making the exit ramps and all that, like, super good. I don't know how they did it. I'm sure it's simple, but I just haven't been taught or learned yet. So if you guys have any suggestions or specific videos that I can watch to understand it, please do share because I want to learn that so we can just go ahead and take that questioning out of it. So, uh, so far, so good. I'm liking this. We have pretty much no demand for anything at all, which is unfortunate because, you know, I could really use more housing. I want to kind of get some going here. Oh, can I move the... Uh... Oh, shit. Let's, let's not do that because that... It doesn't move... Oh, God. It doesn't move the power lines, bro. Are you kidding me? That's hella weird. Okay, well, if that's the case, that's fine. We shouldn't we shouldn't need to move those, but uh, I would like to because I can move everything else, so. We are 5% full on our commercial goods zone, too. 41 tons out of 750. That's a pretty decent amount of goods that are being made. I wish I had more factories, though. But we have such a low demand for uh, factories that I don't think if I were to add any that it would really do any justice, but I will try to see if anyone will soup any up. Because uh, the factories is where we're going to start getting goods produced, and that's what starts helping make money. We're only thirty-four thousand dollars in debt. Three eighty-five on the MN number. We're actually going down, so we might. It's it's not going to go away, but it's definitely going down, which is nice to see. Uh, still no takers on the factories, so we definitely don't have a demand for that. We can go ahead and get some more office buildings uh, put up. So I'm going to continue to work on some stuff since we have nothing else to do while the zoning kind of gets its stuff together. So I want to try to make another freeway that extends out on itself. But unfortunately, this game is so fucking stupid sometimes that you really can't do that without it, I guess, fucking the whole game up. Okay, so we got it there. That's a nice little split. Now, the question is, will they take it when I actually get done building this? So I'm going to I'm going to bring this over the uh, hill here. So that way we can get some freeways into uh, more parts of the area that we have yet to build. And uh, we're going to have to figure out a way to see. I don't want to do too much, though, because we're going to have that overlapping thing with the roads and the freeways, which I really don't want. Uh, let's see how this looks from afar. That's not too bad. I kind of like that, how it's raised and it kind of just did it on its own there. Our freeway system is going to look really uh, messy and convoluted because it's kind of the first time of me actually messing with any freeways in this game. But they're so damn important. It's like not even funny. Uh, we're going to fill out this huge neighborhood here. I think it would be good. They're going to swoop it up almost instantly. Um, and then we can just kind of keep making our way down. But this is looking good so far. So we have a uh, westbound freeway here, uh, which is coming from our southbound freeway, which gets people to this first industrial area that we have. What we could also do is maybe we can make another split off here. I love when it brings it the wrong direction that I don't fucking want. Like, why are you trying to do it that way? I guess I could just to see if it's going to work. Because then what I could do is I can go over the hill here. 
and we can kind of uh, make our way down to the south end of the map. I want to make most of this raised, I think, because if I don't make it raised, uh, we're not going to be able to put roads underneath it, and I think that would be rather important to do. So let's go ahead and raise it once more. Oh, God. Space already occupied. Well, how? Okay, here we go. And then now we got this going back down to the south end of the map. Fairly easy. Wow, it's just going right over everything too, dude. Oh my god, that would be perfect. We can kind of just go like this with it. it says space already occupied, but... Uh, Alright, well, let's backtrack a little then. And we're just going to make a nice little loop. We're going to fix all this up as time goes on. But we'll do this. We're going to go on the outside of this and we're going to start looping back which will make like a nice big circle so that way cars can I don't know that would be the most wickedest fucking freeway system in the world if there was actually something like this dude okay we just need a nice little bend here can we connect these or is it not there we go Okay, good stuff. So that should be a connected freeway system uh, that the people would want to take, which means they could take it if they wanted. But the chances of anyone taking it just yet, there's like nothing down there for them to get around. They would literally just be going around the whole fucking city for no reason. So I doubt that that's the case. Or I doubt that they're going to do that. It would be nice to see so I can know if it was working or not. But that's okay. Uh, but I do like the way that that freeway runs. It kind of goes over the city here and uh, is like all raised... Excuse me, all raised up. I like it. It looks good. That that circle there is a little extreme. But that's okay. That's okay. So what we're doing... Okay, so you see these uh, two beaches. So this beach is actually going to be a beach that the residents can go to. And then this beach over here will be a... Uh, like a port and all that. So we can add kind of like shipping goods and all that fun stuff. Um, so that way stuff can go in and out of the area. Uh, we're going to also add some... There's a boat. There it is. So we're going to just add all three of these. So you're going to see. So we need a shoreline to be able to get this going. I want it to be as straight as possible. There we go. And we're just going to keep going on our way down. I'm going to put a little bit of distance in between them. I'm going to also pause the game. That way it doesn't make anything go belly up. Okay. Now can I move this? Because I would like to move this. So it's not in like the best position. There we go. Looks a little better right there. So when I made these, I didn't realize that uh, there was roads that connected all this shit together. Um, and that if they don't have roads, then no trucks can go ahead and get to it as well. So we're going to need to make some roads. They're going to be a little jank, but they'll work. Uh, let's go ahead and do this right now. I'm not going to worry about curving or anything like that. We're just going to go ahead and connect these suckers together so we can get them connected to a main road here. It's going to be some uh, traveling distance for these people. That's for sure. But uh, they definitely need some ports for ships to go in and out. So we also need power. And we're also going to need water. So let's go ahead and give them a windmill uh, to start off. And we're going to connect it with some uh, power lines. And they're going to have to go inside that little blue thing. So that way they all connect. But I don't really need much uh, housing or anything down here to be truthfully honest. This is going to be strictly for the ports. And now we've got to figure out a way to connect all this stuff together. So I'm thinking what we could do is uh, get it connected to this main road over a bridge. Uh, so that way they just have something. So we're going to take this small road here. And we're going to go out with it. Space already occupied. We'll go fuck yourself. Uh, let's do this. I'm going to move you just a wee bit over. We're probably going to have to get rid of this. So we'll just do it. There we go. Now we can uh, take this road. So it's going to be like a service road that leads to a bigger road here. So that way there's less traffic. Can they make that go across the thing? Probably not. Page down. Oh, you know what? I can make like a tunnel, bro. Ooh, you know how cool that would be? Let's go ahead and see if it'll work. Hold on. Did I go under again? Cannot build on water. Why? Oh, that's so sick. It made a fucking tunnel, dude. All right, let's see if we can continue the tunnel. Okay. Now we're going to go up. What do you mean slope too steep? Let's go down one. 
We're going to have to have it go underneath the houses here. Bam. And we're out the other fucking side, dude. That was the first tunnel I've ever made in this game. Oh my god. That's fucking sick. Okay, okay, okay. I fucks with it. Uh, now we're just going to take this road and we're going to follow it to the other main road that follows the construction. Damn. That was way simpler than I thought it was going to be. Okay, so we have this. Uh, is this a freeway? This is a freeway. That's not good. So we're going to need to figure out a way to connect this one as well, too. And what we're going to connect it uh, as. We also have some other buildings that I would assume we're going to need to probably get squared away with. Let's not have too aggressive of bowing there. And uh, we'll just bring this road up really quick. I want to start raising it up so we can get over this railroad track. I wish that they would auto do the uh, the bridge stuff because it would make our lives so much easier if they did. Okay, it's looking good. I'm going to start bringing it back down. It just has to clear that uh, railroad track. Okay, now we're going to be on the ground level. Perfect. Yeah, that's awesome. Was not expecting us to do that good, dude. Is Are we getting any traffic? Probably not. That's why we need to have multiple ways to get to this uh, area here. Oh, I should probably take our freeway system and connect it here. I'll start uh, swinging it back down and around. And we'll go just over the uh, railroad track. So we'll raise it up twice. Perfect. Start bringing it back down. Again, this is just being placed randomly in uh, areas without any regard to anything else that we're going to build in the future. But at least we'll have a freeway that kind of wraps up and around. This one's going to go through like the forest, which is kind of cool. And we're not taking down too many trees. So we're going to need to start this bend uh, now because we're going to have a freeway. So it has to be able to... Okay, we're going to start here. And another one. Get that bend going. And we're going to keep this raised so that way this road can go underneath this in the future. And we're going to start bringing it back down here. So I'm getting morbidly confused, I'll be honest. Uh, I'm kind of confused on what direction this thing needs to travel. Uh, just due to the fact that... Let's see here. I need to raise this. Can we go above it? Can I connect that? Interesting. Um, so I'm going to try to bring this back down. Now, this is interesting because the, the issue I'm having here is my brain is starting to get like dumbass confused on whether or not what direction this thing should be facing, uh, like the freeway systems and the arrows. So what I'm going to do here is attempt to get one of these connected here so I can get an understanding of what direction that this fucking thing needs to be facing. Because right now we have one way uh so like they're coming down this way they can either split off to go left and go back out or they can go right off here and then they're all going the same direction so this arrow we're having two arrows go completely different directions right now which is the bad part uh so they're not connected here so like this this makes sense for them to go up northbound to get up and out but then uh, this one isn't because they would somehow have to get onto the road. You know what I mean? So that's kind of the difficult part that we're having here. So what I think I need to do is make probably another freeway. So that way my brain understands what we're doing. So we're going to attempt to make another freeway here. It's going to be uh, kind of like a split one right next to each other. We're just going to need to follow the same pattern that we took on the last one. Which will be interesting, because I'm not the best at following the same shit that I've already done. But we're going to try to do it. Eh, so far so good. Uh, could be a lot worse, but we're just trying to make do right now. But once we get another freeway in, then my brain will be able to comprehend how we can make this work. But right now, it's just not happening, champ. It is not happening what so fucking ever. Alright, now we've got to start raising again. This is just too fucking simple, dude. I'm like a professional at the whole uh, lifted ground shit now. We're going to go back down to the ground. Okay, so now we have another freeway that's uh, well, not actually done yet. But you know what they say, right? Uh, so we're just going to follow this up in the other one. Then we'll have another... Oh, fuck, I got to back up. Have another route that we can take that can be a different direction than the other one that's it's going. 
Uh, and then they can be connected via the roadway or something. We'll figure it out. This is like a first for me doing freeways. So I, that's why I like to practice it on my laptop. So that way when we do get in, I'm not a complete idiot. But I think this is uh, goes to show that I'm trying to learn here as best as possible. We're having some uh, difficulty turning the way I would like. There we go. So I'm going to stop it right there. That way I can mentally visualize what the fuck is going on and we can kind of get this squared away really quick. So I'm going to leave the freeway system for another time because that shit is confusing. I'm going to add a few more uh, houses here in this area and then we're going to wrap it up on this episode. because so I'm going to go get started on some LSPDFR. I got that uh, somewhat fixed up from the last time that it shit itself. So I guess that's a plus. But we've made some good work. Uh, it's, you know, a little bit messy looking with the freeway system, but it's super important that we kind of put it down so that way we can make sure our industrial areas are connected. Again, any suggestions that you guys have, I would love to hear them. So that way we're making the best moves here. Again, this is all new. So if I'm doing it like not wrong, I don't think there's any way to do it wrong. It's just not the best way probably then uh, time to learn. So nonetheless, thank you so much for coming out and watching this episode of City Skylines, and we will see you next video.